Hi there, and welcome to this course in the turbulence and CFD models. So, the first thing is that I would like to invite you to visit the web the, the web page, okay, and just look at the all the material that we have here. So, short course presentation here, our all the lectures notes. And we're going to focus here in the tutorials. Okay, so you always visit here because we're continuously updating this material. But in this case, uh, I would like to focus in the first tutorial, tutorial zero. So here you have everything. Tutorial zero will be the introduction, the introductory tutorial. So as you go here, click here, you, you have the material. So in this case, we have fluid mesh and the solution. So this is, you have the solutions you get lost, but here you have the starting point, the fluid, fluid mesh. So let me click here and just to show you what we're going to do. Okay. So this is the case that we're going to work just to introduce you to the first part. Okay. We're still not going to work into the theory and all the turbulence model and stuff just to see it, show you how to use uh, affluent and the workbench. So basically what we have is this geometry. Okay. And we're giving you already the mesh and we're going to set out these boundary conditions. Okay. It's a quite simple case, but just to learn how to do this. And so this is the mesh that we have. Okay. It's, and then we're going to, after running this a fast simulation, some qualitative results. So we have uh the mid cut plane we we have here velocity pressure we have here temperature also we have here the turbulent viscosity so all this course is about turbulence and it's about this quantity this is not a physical quantity this is a quantity introduced by the model in order to correct the the mixing and the wall shear stresses later we're going to talk about this but we have it here and where you have the largest values is where the turbulence model what well, the turbulence model is kicking in so all this is qualitative results also we can look at some quantities at the wall later we're going to talk about what is y plus but it can be also related to the wall shear stresses and here we are releasing some lines from this inlet here and they're colored by velocity so these are all qualitative results but also we have quantitative results. Okay. Besides those nice colors, we can measure quantity. So here you have a figure, but here at the end of the day in ANSYS Fluent, you will have here uh, a command uh, reports and you can compute integrals. So in this case, we have uh, like my, my uh, mass flows and all the surface boundaries. And also we can compute some other quantities. So for example, here we have the average temperature at the outlet. Okay, so it's not only colors, it's also about uh, quanti uh, uh, quantitative quantities. So this is what we're going to do, a uh, very easy case. So download the material, just the, the, the mesh, have in mind that we're using the latest ver student version, the 2022, but I think uh, all these cases should work with version 2020 and newer. So that's all for the case introductions. Thank you for your attention. See you next video. Bye.